Every sport has its ideal conditions, and when the wind is just right and nature paints a masterpiece of a day, it's magic time for those who seek challenge where the sea and the sky collide. Like pilgrims, they'll converge at the shore and then set off on highly individual quests. At windsurfing's upper echelon, speed is only part of the thrill. The real rush is to gain air, to blur the line between wave and wind. This spot in Oregon is known as the Gorge. Here the prevailing winds are so perfect so often, it's a mecca for the windsurfing elite and a showcase for the hottest new designs and innovations. The gear made popular here is lightweight, about 15 pounds, enabling the pros to reach speeds of up to 50 miles an hour and heights of up to 20 feet. From the Phoenicians to the Polynesians to the British Armada of Sir Francis Drake, man has always sought control of the high seas. But has anyone ever ruled the waves like this? <laughs> 